In this video, I will show you the Bloody Mouse macro settings for Crone and Squall. Pay attention! The following macro settings only work correctly on this loadout and settings. Now let's go to the in-game settings of the mouse, set the mouse sensitivity to 5. The ADS sensitivity multiplier to 1. The ADS sensitivity multiplier focus to 1. The ADS mouse sensitivity type to legacy MW, and the custom sensitivity presumed to off. If the in-game sensitivity of your mouse is not 5, the macro settings that will be presented in this video will not work properly, but since the DPI of the mouse does not affect the operation of the macro settings, you can use the formula EDPI that I will explain below to solve this problem. EDPI is equal to the DPI of the mouse, multiplied by the in-game sensitivity of the mouse, and you are playing with the EDPI. For example, if your in-game sensitivity is 2 and the DPI of your mouse is 1000, your EDPI will be 2000. Now, if you change the in-game sensitivity of the mouse to 5, you must set the DPI of the mouse to 400, so that the EDPI value does not change. In this way your EDPI value will remain constant. Let's go to the macro settings of Bloody Mouse, open Bloody 7 application. Choose Ultra Core 3. Click on Headshot tab. Here you need to create a folder for the game. If you have already created one, select it. Now continue the steps according to the video and make the settings.